All right, welcome back to Cricket for Americans. Nick here, and I am bringing you another solo reaction to another request from Shankar Gopal89. Thank you so much for the request. And I so much appreciate all the different requests that he sends us and so many others sends us. And there's some that a lot of you have sent us that are really good that I can't really do alone because you got to have a Gabe or other um, Jody and whatnot here. But since they're not available, I figured this would be a really good one of his requests to do solo like I did yesterday when I checked out the uh, first ever bowl out internationally. I think it was the first ever. So... Today, I'm looking at a video from Cricket Cloud. I had someone on the live stream yesterday mention, hey, go check out Cricket Cloud, see if you can react to some of their videos. So here we go. Once again, this may be a no video reaction based on what YouTube does, or this may be a full on reaction based on what YouTube does. But I'm going to go ahead and check this out. Nonetheless, this is a video titled, Savog forgot it's a test match. He forgot it's a test match. Highly doubt that. All West Indies bowlers shot. I swear I'm not picking up, picking on you, West Indies. I promise you I'm not picking on you right now. The last two videos, solar reactions, have both been against the West Indies. He forgot it's a test match. Let's see. Verinder Savag at his best, his 12th 100. Okay, so he must have just lost his mind in the test match. Meaning that's why he forgot. Hit that subscribe button. And I'm going to go ahead and check this out. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll see him going nuts and forgetting all about test match nonsense. And here we go. And that spanked away. Short and four. That's spanked away. So say why, yeah, it in was. typical fashion, gets off the mark with a boundary. He's got to be with pretty cautious, though. Punched away again. Getting that Another chase. The fielders there. And this time it's fu futile. So cover drive there. Woo! Collins has some work to do. Behind and him on the onside. Look at the mean. bowler. He's like. Ooh, right the boundary is struck. And there's an effort, that last one, to try Straight and drive. get it up there, and he's got two full. Another he's, boundary. He's just peppering it. Wow. That's what we call in baseball, over. just peppering it all over the field there. India racing away, 39 without loss. Jeez, I wonder what over that is. 45 that is absolutely loss. hammered. Crushed it. By Sewag. Problems here for Lara. Day one Problems from Problems of the Marinda Sewa kind. Seventh boundary and 26 balls he's faced. A bit of width. Seventh just boundary. just come down from high on top of the ball. Balls. Could be four as well. And wow. it is for boundary number eight for Sewa. 58 without loss. That's oh! gone a long way. Forget down that. The boundary. It's over the boundary line. That's a How six, many? baby. Reservation for six. The umpire wants to have a look. Look at what? Six, it'll be 50 to oh, see gone, one. brother. Big strike of the ball, giving him woods outside off. Did I read that right? Did it say India won a toss? Because he sets himself up. <laughs> yeah, that's it's definitely a six. six. He got a six 50 on 33 yeah, balls. So that's 50. Eight, four. Oh, it's a test match. Call it. Has boy. raced past the other the boundary right, right there. Ganga. Ganga just had a quick look yeah, up, glance the out of the corner of his eye and it was gone. Again, it's width. This is short as well, but Jeez. it's width outside that. Now outside. that one's pretty dangerous because that was close to the slip it's there. Set a up little there. bit of an edge. He got, I mean, it's more than an edge. Say he got some, uh, some bad on that, that, but close that was just a little risky. It bounces, but it, but again, he's just peppering it. it in between every fielder all around the oval there. 360 degrees. Watch out, umpire hasn't come at you yet with the ball. Oh! He is on fire. He Jeez. really is. One, two, and a half he bounces. Taking this apart. Third yeah, bounce on the boundary, I think. Yeah, the sense of brutality. Look at that over. A one, a well, six. This is a stroke. A dot, a four, and a four. Because this has been brought in a little closer by Bravo. Great form right there. Is he just on about off stump there? Maybe Onside just outside. There. He just swung Ooh. through the line. Doesn't worry him about hitting the ball in the air. 
No, so he's he's just taking what he's getting right there. 36 right balls, now. 10 fours. Score 58. Jeez. Calm down. Oh! Many more. What did this baller do to you? It's gone for six. Look at the umpire. He is holding the hat like they said they used to before the COVID. Over. 79 without loss. Two sixes on that over. Two fours. Man, that bowler is expensive. Who was that bowler? Good afternoon. Was that good morning? Good afternoon and good night. <laughs> Don't take it seriously, bro. Hit for 21 off his second over. Jeez. The culmination of that Look over. Look at that. Nice, easy, easy stroke right there. The ground. Nice, easy little mechanics there. Not trying to do too much. In the air, and that might be four. Punches it, it against the ground as it flies down. Man, that's a fast infield. Deliveries. And that's where he likes them. Doesn't have to move his feet. That was masterful right there. Magnificent. Oh. You do not get sick and tired of watching a guy when he's in form like this. Verinda Sawag at his best. I was just going to say, but I'll, I'll say that for after the video. And crash, oh! bang, boom. Oh, okay, Sawag. that bounced for two times. I don't know what he's had for breakfast, but I wouldn't mind some of it. <laughs> but he's decided to take Dwayne Bravo on, Sawag. Dwayne Bravo? How dare you? Both very competitive individuals and probably had a bit to say to each other. Look at Savon so commanding far. the pitch right there. And He's in the middle. A few steps up on the crease. He does that that was out of the reach. Times, just opening the face 137 the for no loss. There was a sense that he's, got the, he's got the look, man. He's got the focus in the, the eyes. Moment and meant to hit it up. Well, he's gone for it. But will just get the single out? It could have been a directed. There was an opportunity, there was an overthrow, the ball going to deep fine leg. Ooh. But we're in the Seba get overrun it and he looks very disappointed. <laughs> the clock, the word bubbles. Can he get a one? He can. His 12th test 100 for Verinda uh. Sevag. And one that will re be remembered for a very long time. For the few spectators who are here, there are not many of them. The would be perhaps a, a thousand or thereabouts. And so for those watching on television as well, it's been a tremendous innings by B. 78 balls, 15 Sawag. fours. Wonder what he scored that day. Did he get out pretty soon after that? Did he get out right after that? So I was going to say, this guy is in serious form. He's just in the zone, and there's nothing you can do about it. Nothing you can do about that. When someone's in that form, when someone's in that zone, all you can hope is to contain, my friend. All you can hope to do is contain. And he, he was just on a mission. I mean, he the ball must have looked like a basketball to him as he's hitting those shots. His footwork was pretty tight. Near the end there, though, he like like on a runway or something, he was running up that pitch, it seemed, three or four steps away from the crease as he's just doing what he wants. It was interesting, and they mentioned it too, how he was like visibly upset. He didn't get the boundary, though, the ball before they showed in the highlight there. I'm trying to get 100 right here. Why is my boundary? Why is there a fielder there? This because everywhere he was hitting it, there was no fielders. From what they were showing, at least, he got himself a few sixes. Oh, man, I love the six. He got himself a bazillion boundaries. Man, I wonder, what was his score on that? What was his score? Again, if you weren't able to see the video, this is going to be a no video reaction. If it is a no video reaction, I will post the full reaction on my Patreon, on our Patreon, the Born Review Patreon that we use for all channels. But, I mean, honestly, what's the mentality of the bowler there? Obviously, you just want to contain, you want to limit the damage as much as possible. But do you go outside yourself and say, this guy's in a different level, different zone. I'm going to give him something he's not expecting with taking the risk of exposing yourself because you're going with your second or third tier um, stuff, but you're trying to get this guy off balance. I wonder when you're the captain, you're like, okay, we're gonna send, uh, we're gonna send the the, the part time bowler in there, who wasn't gonna see light of day till at least the thirtieth over. We're bringing him in right now because this guy's out of his mind. I mean, do you do that or do you still stick with your horses, still stick with your best, and say eventually? Mano e mano, what are you going to do? Or 
Do you sometimes just eat it? Like this guy, I, I don't know. There's different options. If it was me, I would be tempted after about the 15th or 20th over of that. And I didn't even think it lasted that long because his strike rate was over 100. So maybe after the 10th over. And this guy's just rocking and rocking and rocking, especially that one expensive one where he scored, what was it, 12 and then 9, so 21. After that one, I'm like, all right, you, you got to give him something he's not expecting. You know that that ball you've been practicing with? I know you're not a spinner, pace bowler, but you're going to give us some uh, some spinning action. Give us the flipper for crying out loud. Give your best impression of Shane Warren. What, what can you do? That's crazy. I wonder what are some other ones where someone just started off in the test match, just bonkers like that, Pontonian-like, where they just started off the match like in a craze and they were just, I'm starving, I'm going to eat up as many balls as I can, I'm going to send them back the other way for some boundaries, maybe over the boundary, maybe mix in a few singles and doubles, but all I'm interested in is the big stuff. Let me know, what are some of those performances that you can think of and then let me do me a huge favor. Do us a huge favor. Give do yourself a favor of us request or us reacting to at to that with all the 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 list of videos we have, and go ahead and see if there's a link to a video that's a non-official cricket channel that we can check out. But that was a lot of fun. We've seen Verinder Savog, me and Gabe reacted to it on a Cricket Tuesday not too long ago when he got his 195 in the Robolinda video. This one was also very impressive. I mean, he's one of the guys that I've heard his name about for a long time and I can see why I mean this guy when he's on it I mean you just you can't stop this guy you can't stop it and sorry West Indies it had to be against you I promise I'm not trying to punish you but that was impressive I love the batting and that was an impressive little display right there but those are my thoughts let me know what are your thoughts don't forget to like and subscribe and until next time Adios.